If you are getting your first diagnostic tool, you are probably choosing between code reader and Bluetooth OBD adapter paired with your smartphone. They are both in similar price range. This VP costs $18 plus $5 for the app, so $23. Until code reader, it cost me, I think, around $24, so both under $25. Which one you should choose and why? Both of these types of OBD scanner have some advantages to them, and I will quickly explain it to you. Okay, code reader is very simple to use. You just plug it in, it uses power directly from your OBD port, it will start automatically and you can start checking your car's data. The Bluetooth OBD adapter, I mean, it is still simple to use, but you are connecting via Bluetooth and sometimes you can get some connection issues. This VPIC is very reliable, but few times it happened that I had some connection issues. Code reader is also faster, because you have wired connection and it is faster than Bluetooth. Now the difference is... The comparison will be between this code reader and car scanner app. This is probably best OBD2 app you can get for your smartphone. The code reader is simpler to use, but Bluetooth adapter will have more features. For example, reading default codes. If you go to read codes, it will display the code just from your engine. On the other hand, the car scanner app can actually read codes from all your modules. Okay, if I press read codes, and if you are wondering how the hell can I have connected two different scanners at once, I don't. This one is connected to my car, and the Bluetooth app, this is just the demo version. You can try it at home, you can just download the car scanner app, press demo, and you can test out its features without connecting to vehicle. This Toyota does have more than 30 control modules, and yes, the engine is most important, but you have other systems in your vehicle, and with Bluetooth app you could read codes from them, not just from the engine. Okay, the next difference is reading the live data. The live data are single best feature you can have to diagnose your engine problems. Okay, so this are the live data. If I press on the gas pedal, they should start to change. But what I want to show you is when you diagnose your faults, the graphic displaying of live data can be very useful. And this code reader, I mean, cheap code readers usually don't have graphic displaying. This one does. So if I press on the gas pedal, we should have our values change. So you can use it to diagnose your engine systems and that is useful but on chip code reader we can see only one graph at a time with most problems you need to look at least at two or three different live data values at once with the app what i can do is okay i can go to live data i can choose either separate or combined okay i'll already have two different graphs and i can even add more no i will just select random items this is just demo but see it is much easier because i can see different live data graphs at once what i can also do this app actually have the coding feature now i cannot see it here because i am in the demo version but you can actually use this app to unlock hidden features of your vehicle for example with this app i was able to code window opening from my key fob because it wasn't enabled from factory Okay, and I did it with this app. It doesn't have coding for every vehicle, but for some it does. And the big advantage is also that you can use this adapter with different apps. I mean, I can use it with 100 different OBD apps. I can use it with one that can unlock hidden features. I can use it with car scanner that is very good for diagnosing problems. So you have more functionality with Bluetooth OBD adapter. But on the other hand, the code reader is just more reliable. It will last you easily 10 years without breaking down you won't have any issues any headache with connecting so if you want to have very simple device that is always ready pick the code reader if you want to have more functionality pick bluetooth obd adapter i tried bunch of engine code readers i tried a bunch of bluetooth obd adapters so if you want to choose either bluetooth or code reader i will link those two videos here i have comparison for both types of obd scanners and you can choose the best